Hi there, thanks for joining me today. Today on My Digital Studio, I'm just going to show you a really quick trick on how I'm going to get my page. I've started with my background paper, that is the Right Stuff um, add on that you can purchase um, at stampinup.com for this designer paper. And now I want another designer paper layer on my page. In order to do that, I'm just going to scroll down here and I'm actually going to use a punch to make my rectangle. And I find this easier because you can't use the um, paper and stretch it um, or you're going to pixelate it and it's going to look all fuzzy in your finished picture or project. So I'm just going to take a square punch and I'm going to now make it a layer on my page. So you can see there that I've got myself a nice long rectangle. And actually maybe what I'll do is I'm going to color fill this first. So I just click on color fill and I'm going to do maybe really rust and hit OK. And now again I'm going to go to add punch. I'm going to take that square punch, click it, drag it over here. And now I'm going to add another layer on top of this and I'm going to do basic black I think. I'm going to paper fill it using designer series paper. So come down here to paper fill for that punch and I'm going to go with let's go large polka dot might change this on my finished one double click it come down here to basic black select OK and I've got myself that basic black layer if I didn't do that what would end up happening is um, I would have to go into page layer and cut my paper to be the size that I want. So I find it easier to fill a punch than I do to go through those troubles. So I'll show you the finished page at the end and I hope you have a great day. Take care.